it's been a long road back to title contention and a heavyweight championship opportunity for this man, but he has put in all the right work, and a lot of people give him a great chance to get the job done tonight. You know, when you've been there and you get back here, it's not new. There are a lot of things that are familiar, but how do you change the result? How do you assure that in this time, during this chance, you ultimately walk away with the championship? He's been here before, John. The team's been here before. They are confident that this time they get it done. And that self-belief is rooted in the preparation, right? He's got speed, he's got power, all the tools to wrest the belt away. We'll see if we have a new UFC heavyweight champion by night's end. can argue this is the most influential martial artist of all time, the great Bruce Lee, making his walk to the octagon here tonight, Jim. Everybody wants to be Bruce Lee. They say they want to be like Mike. If you're a fighter, you want it to be like Bruce Lee. You want it to be that fast. You want it to be that charismatic. You want it to have an ability to just freeze your opponents. Your speed, your movement, just the diversity in the attacks that you can give your opponents would just confuse people. I mean, I watched him beat a seven-foot Kareem Abdul-Jabbar to stay undefeated. Right. If you could do that, you could do anything. I fear not the man who has practiced 10,000 kicks once, but I fear the man who has practiced one kick 10,000 times, Bruce Lee, in a nutshell. Just so wise. Our tale of the tape for this heavyweight championship fight. Here's Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. <laughs> This one just about to get underway. Well, a few better fight atmospheres than this one. We are at the Scotiabank Arena here in Toronto. Fans are lathered early. We're going to have some Florida Canadians by the time this night's over. They're in the building early. They stay late. Canadians are there for a fight, and they show up in droves. Lee gets stung by that leg kick. Let's go. Get out of there. Separate. Make your space. Oh, left hook to the head. It's blocked. Beautiful jab there by the champ. Straight right hand now just misses. Nasty body kick downstairs. Oh, he lands a kick to the leg. Oh, big knee to the body. That'll soften him up. And he blocks the shot there. Takedown defense holds up. And they separate after exiting the clinch. Nice shot there by the champ. Throwing that jab, no good. Oh, he makes a huge knee to the body. Back to his feet. Sides with conviction. 
closes the gap and gets the single collar tie now. Came on inches right there, boy. Wow. It was a good night if that landed. Trying to go to the body here, unable to find the target. Three minutes to go. Another blistering combination there, really starting to do a nice job stringing his shots together. And you can see the damage in his opponent's body, his face, his body, his legs. He's beating him up on all the targets. It's not one guy just headhunting. He is finding every opening that is presented to him. Shot finds the target there. Great shot lands. Now he's got to go find that follow-up attempt. The kill shot is what they call it to go and end the fight. Big head kick. Oh, that right hand barely missed there. Well, he continues to offer up the kick here, but just misses with that one. Big power shot there. Overhand by Lee. Under two minutes now to go. All right, so now we start to see some redness underneath the elbow. You got to think he's going to continue to attack the body with all of his strikes. Oh! Big right hand there. Oh, nice kick. Just misses with the straight leg. Nice kick. All right, so look at that. A cut has been opened around that eye area. He's taking shots over and over again to that area, and now he's dealing with a cut. Hard shots landing on both sides here. Trying to go to the body now with the kick. That one misses. Beautiful timing on that takedown. He secures the takedown. Look at the posture now and try to land some ground. Pretty productive with the strikes here off his back. Screw getting absolutely worked here from the top. These are some very effective ground and pound strikes. Now drops inside that first guard PC. Full cool guard. Let's see how patient he is as he attacks a submission or big ground and pound. Well, working pretty effectively from the top here. Nice ground and pound by Lee. Going to the mount. And there it is. Another strike gets through on the ground. Strews in half guard. Seconds winding down in the opening round. He continues to bully his opponent here, really manhandling him on the ground. Round two straight ahead. Oh, stop, stop, stop. All right, take a seat, bud. Breathe, relax. All right, let's settle down a little bit. We need to get a little more accurate on those kicks. I need those to land this round. You ready to fight? Ready. Second ready. round underway. All right, here we go with our next round. A lot to be happy about in that previous round. He was attacking the head at will, and until his opponent adjusts, might as well go back to it. There was no negative to him headhunting. Most times the coaches yell, don't headhunt, don't headhunt. I'm yelling headhunt if right, I'm his corner, right. because every time he's thrown, he's landing. Check that last one. Lee gets caught by the inside leg kick. Well, that punch, no good. Relax, relax. Keep your hands. Oh, picture perfect shot there, DC, and 
one more of those, he might be out. I mean, the fight is gonna be over. I can't believe he's still standing. That shot landed perfect. Calf kick lands, and it is starting to bruise now. Dude better check these kicks. He's not gonna be able to fight too long if he doesn't. Beautiful straight right hand. Beautiful, beautiful. Keep that now. Oh, nice land there with the punch. You see, he's taking advantage of what is an obvious edge in reach. Beautiful leg kick land. March on, three minutes to go. All right, so he lands again, just like we saw in the last round, realizing a lot of success with his Muay Thai game tonight. You know why change it? It's working, and it's working from the very start of the fight. The moment this fight started, you saw the advantage that we predicted was there. He started to take advantage of it early, and now he's continuing to build on that. This kickboxer looks amazing right now. All right, so now his body language really starting to change and the bruises starting to accumulate on that side. I mean, you're looking at it, right? When you can visibly see the damage on the body, you know that the work has been done. What a beautiful game plan put together by this team. Well, he has really picked up the pace here in round two, much more aggressive than we saw in round one, and now starting to find himself in the pocket. Great job getting that punch to the target. He's gonna get himself knocked out. He gotta take a moment. He's gonna get knocked out. He doesn't take a break. Oh, how about the accuracy to land right there? His opponent's wobble champ. He's hurt bad. He cannot take another shot like that. Oh, pinpoint accuracy on the hook right there, DC. That is a tremendous strike. Like Alex Pajeda, you develop a great hook, you can end nights of your <laughs> Lee gets caught with that punch. Don't be afraid to get that head off the center line. Oh, another strike to the torso right there. Gotta get better defensively or that's gonna be a real factor as this fight continues. He's gotta tuck that elbow. Yeah. I mean, he's got that elbow flaring and every time his opponent's going right up. Both tough, both durable, both unwilling to take a step back. What a phenomenal fight. Oh, nice, right in. Tags him with the uppercut. Man, he is so sound defensively. Nice job to raise the guard there. It's the relaxation that allows him to see things coming and block most of the strikes that are coming at him. Good punch, man. 30 seconds to go in the round. Oh, just misses with the kick. Oh, Ten seconds now to go in the round. Stroog's really having a hard time putting weight on that leg now. You can see the obvious limp, and a lot of that is due to the leg kicks courtesy of his opponent. You ready to fight? Ready. Here we go, third round of this championship fight. 
Also, the taller fighter lands a knee yet again. All right, next round is now underway. Hopefully, the action continues at a high level. Oh, you got to start to look to finish him now. Hook shot attempt to the head here. Instead, it's blocked by the skyscraper, Stefan Struve. Connected with a solid strike there. Oh, and yet another knee finds the target. So a huge moment here. Now we'll see if he can follow it up. Beautiful shot lands to the leg there. Struve's left leg appeared to be damaged by that last kick, so could be an emerging storyline as this fight continues. on that offering. Back and forth we go. Man, where were these cap kicks 15 years ago? Another strike targets that area. I mean, lands and once again. Oh, is that a huge strike right there? I'm not sure how many more of these his opponent can take. Massive shot that he landed. Great job. Oh, he lands a big left hand. Well, we'll see if he can turn this defense into offense, but he's doing a great job blocking shots here tonight. Oh, he is hurting for certain. Just over three minutes to go in round three. Lee's really limping heavily now. The leg kicks have started to pile up. Clearly, they're having the desired effect. Short uppercut here in the clinch by Struve. Immediately gets the underhook. That kick lands. He does everything so well. And he's so calm. He's so calm in the face of such a big spot. We have crossed the midpoint of this one. Oh, here comes the kick. That one blocked by Lee. Well, we wondered earlier why there weren't as many body strikes. He's making up for lost time here. Shot to the body connects, and that bears watching. That's going to hurt this opponent. Ooh, head kick lands. Hurt. And he lands a knee. I want you to make that cut worse now. Pretty good jab there by Lee. Oh, nice right hand, John. Circling to his right. Well, you've got to admire the urgency here. He is trying to keep the judges out of it. Lighten up his opponent left and right. 90 seconds to go now. Felt good as he lands the knee to the body. He's a tall fighter and is going to have the size advantage against most opposition in this division. Lee gets touched by that leg kick attempt. Oh, heavy kick to the body. One minute now to go in the third. Oh, beautiful jab there. It's one thing to have length. Of course, it's another to use it effectively. Beautiful job with that jab. Oh, a huge strike lands there, DC. He landed that massive shot. Now he needs to try to find the next shot, the follow-up shot that will finish the fight. We got a lot of blood now, ladies and gentlemen. I think my mother just turned off the TV, but every time that area gets targeted, that cut is... You gotta watch his neck. That Darce choke is tight.
All right, so there's the end of the round. You see the blood trickling stop, down stop, as he stop. makes his way back to the stool. Cut on the bridge of the nose, or so it appears from the strike in that round. Cut man getting right to work. little blood. You've been here before. You've been cut. No worries. We like the taste of our own blood. Now's the chance to go out there and get all right, well, one minute of end swell can only do so much. Let us look back at some of the damaging strikes in that previous round. It doesn't seem like it's going to do much. And if it does, he can't take any more of these shots. He was too stationary. He took everything square on the target. He's got to move his head, and he's got to be proactive instead of reactive in terms of his defenses. Ready to fight? Ready. Do we have arrived at the fourth round fight schedule for five five-minute rounds. All right, so here we go. You can feel the tension. Fourth round is underway. We'll see who has the upper hand here. You feel it inside of the arena. The fighters feel it inside of the octagon. It's palpable. The energy is crazy because you under... Oh! Trying to recover, but he's in a lot of trouble. So once again, leaning on that long reach as he counters effectively jab to the head. Straight punch lands. Well, not only has he stayed aggressive as he was in the previous round, landing a high volume of strikes, but he's also been efficient, not just with his strikes, but also with his body movement. Complete performance out of this fighter here tonight. Good body shot. Well, this fight's been pretty crazy thus far. Both guys doling out a lot of damage, and neither seems to bother by it, but clearly both parties are hurt. Both guys are hurt. Both guys are fighting beautifully. Both are showing a lot of heart right now in this fight. They're both doing amazing jobs. Let's see who gets the job done at the end of the game. Pretty good head kick there. Lands that beautiful jab. Slips the punch. Let's open up that cut more now. Just over three minutes to go now. Missed on the front kick there. Oh, get behind that right. Huge connection by him there. He needs to get on his bicycle, John. He needs to get into space so that he doesn't get finished. Oh, oh, right hand. Oh, he continues to land a high number of strikes in this round. Really hasn't let up when it comes to his aggressiveness. Certainly have to be mindful that you don't gas out, but you gotta like the output on display here. Just misses with the jab there. Struve's really targeting that cut right now, and why not? He has opened up his opponent. Might as well continue to attack that particular area. up on that right side right now. He's got to figure out a way to lower that elbow. Don't want to take too many more shots to that midsection. Under two minutes to go. Oh, man. This is one thing you, you do not want to get kicked in the head in MS. You cannot take too many of those head kicks, but this guy gets his leg up there so fast, sometimes you don't see it coming. Work. Oh, back and forth we go. All right, they separate now. We'll see who can get off in space. Beautifully timed and place kick there by Lee. Bleeding now. Nasty cut on his nose. One minute to go in the round. Beautiful. And a nice job at least staying upright on that. Oh, 
good block there. Relax. Keep those hands high. Well, straight right hand has been a good weapon for him. He misses with it there. single collar tie there. Well, I think I can smell the blood at this point in time. That canvas didn't look like that a few fights ago. Blood is flowing from that cut with every passing strike. Every strike. And it burns. John, it burns so bad. When you get cut like that, every time. He's rocked. Oh, what a way to end the round. He got stunned by a huge shot there just before you heard the horn. So he gets saved by the bell. The question is, though, what type of condition will he be in when he gets up off that stool? 60 seconds here to recover. The onus is on his corner to keep his head in the fight. All right, so there's the end of the round. He stayed committed to doing damage upstairs and landed a seminal blow in that round. It was accumulation of those strikes. He kept hitting him over and over to the head. Eventually, he found the, the one that really did damage his opponent. Ready to fight. Ready. Fifth and final round, fourth cover. Nice strike. Landed that left hook. Nice leg kick. And he is back up to his feet. Just out of range with that right hand. Oh, big elbow. Put your hands up higher. Come on. Oh, nice straight punch there. Oh, what a connection by him there. His career could be out of here soon, DC. He's almost done. I mean, when you get hit with a shot like that, you don't know whether to run, hide, or on his first test in elevator. Struz going for an arm here. Oh, looks like he's got the arm isolated. He's got it isolated and working towards the finish. This guy is so aware. He never leaves anything long to allow for himself to get subbed. All right, we'll see if he can apply pressure inside his opponent's guard here, DC. And he's back to his feet. Good sign for him there. Tried to go to the body, but unable to connect. He's wobbling now. Just over three minutes now to go in the fight. Well, you got him all with the toughness as he eats yet another calf kick to that lead leg. Well, he's tough, but eventually the body just shuts down. If he takes many more of those, he's gonna end up having to go down to the ground. He needs to switch stances right now. as far as that midsection is concerned. Might have a fractured rib. He's going to be urinating blood for a week. <laughs> this dude's in trouble. He's in trouble. Maybe time to get the bonus checks ready. I mean, this fight is about done. He's got him hurt very bad with his head kick. So now he has to find one more strike to end the night. Good shot, good shot. Big right hand. They're going at it here. Huge shots landing on both sides. Time to hit the Sunoco station. Both of these fighters are on empty. This looks like when I played video games as a seven-year-old. <laughs> I didn't do nothing but butt mashing. Oh, you heard it real bad. Man, these guys have some chins on them. Huge shots being landed on both sides. Oh, my goodness. Boom! Oh, and they strike till the end. shot of 
of this entire fight. He landed a massive hook to put his opponent on wobbly legs. Well, he was setting up the hooks early and often tonight. Watch for him to try to set it up again here. Oh, brilliant execution to land the roundhouse. It got checked. All right, single collar tie now. One minute to go in the fight. Well, watch for him to set up that hook again here. And there it is, the fighter lands yet another hook. Big inside kick. Lee gets caught again, and once again, it's the inside leg kick. Well, you know Rogan's pissed he missed this one. We are witnessing an instant classic. Back and forth we go. Both fighters have been on the cusp of being finished, and both have exuded a ton of fun. Yeah, they both show heart, courage, ability, technical skills. I can't really tell you how these two are still in the fight with the damage that they both are exhibiting on their face. Very badly. The Ladies official decision is in. It resides with Bruce Buffett. We go to the judges' scorecards for a decision. All three judges score this contest 48 47. Declaring the winner by unanimous decision and still the undisputed UFC heavyweight champion of the world, Bruce the Dragon. So the legend Bruce Lee does it again. That was a prime performance out of the martial arts legend tonight. This man, of course, has had no shortage of...